Hello guys, how are you? Hope you all are doing well. Today I am back with one of the most interesting video. In this video tutorial, guys, we will learn how to fix if your call history is not showing on your Android phone. In this video, we will learn this, guys. Okay. So for this, guys, you can follow this easy and very simple methods. So first method is this, guys. First, you need to open your phone settings, and in the phone settings, go to apps and notification, and open your phone app from here. Okay. After this, guys, go to permission, and in the permission here, you can get the option call locks. If the feature was, if the option was disabled, just you need to enable it. Okay. After enabling, go to once again your call history, and here you can get the call history back on your phone in case still you are facing same type of problem now you can follow this next method go to your phone settings once again go to apps and notification go to all apps and here in the top right side corner of your screen here you can get the three dots option just tap on it and here you need to select show system okay after this guys here you need to find out call logs open it go to storage and clear the catches of this app go back and here you can get the option notification just open it and you need to enable this notification and just tap on fourth stop one time okay after these guys you need to restart your phone one time after restarting open your call history now it will fix your problem 100% okay still in case you're facing same type of problem now what you need to do once again open your phone setting go to apps and notification all apps from here you need to find out your dialer app phone app scroll down and find out it okay like this go to storage clear the catches just you need to clear the catches okay after this guys go back go back and restart your phone one more time after restarting you need to update your phone app from the play store okay open the play store and here you need to search phone app just you need to update your default phone app which you are using i am using google phone app as you can see guys just you need to update it okay after updating now it will fix your problem 100% so these are the easy and simple solutions to fix this problem so that's it for today guys the short and very simple video hope you enjoy this if you enjoy please guys don't go back without like share and subscribe to our channel thank you very much